What up, though, to all my fly guys and fly girls out there? What up, though? It's your boy, you're Always Fresh, and you tuned in to another episode of Off the Box Fresh. Now, today is business as usual. Um, I had like two other unboxing videos, but I recorded them in 8K and they just won't upload. So, I, uh, I was trying to edit them. It wouldn't edit, so and I used Power Director on my phones, so um, it just wasn't uploaded. So I uh, just went ahead and deleted them. But I'm gonna show you in this video. I just got two um, brand. I actually got five, but they not even new. But I got two brand new pickups, and I'm gonna show you the stuff that I tried to unbox um, previously but it didn't um, I messed with like I said I recorded an 8k instead of uh, just regular uh, 4k or whatever HD but anyway um, before I get to these I just want to show y'all got some uh, new University of Fresh shipping bags um, I had to get some big ones to fit the hoodies and stuff in. So, when y'all order, y'all will get it in good packaging. You know what I'm saying? We're not just shipping shipping it to you in your kind of way. So, yeah, I know some people might wonder. Just be it like a new brand or, you know, upcoming company. You probably think we'd be, uh, Slacking and lacking or whatever, but we not. We coming with it. Um, also, New Era had a seven had a seventy and a anniversary uh, a couple of weeks ago, and I went on there and um, cop this boy. As you can see, it got the it came with some uh, the seventy pendants. Side, you got the uh, it's the old Tiger Stadium. So Michigan and Trumbull, um, they play at Comerica Park now. So yeah, this say from 1912 to 1999. Yep. So yeah, they no longer play here, but they still do like whole like um, events here and stuff. And it's still a baseball field there, so I guess like. Maybe little league play there, or maybe high school or something. Um, not for sure, but uh, you can see this lid. This Pender got 59, 57 anniversary. This one got 1954 to 2024. 70 anniversary on this one, so yeah, this was part of my cops um, for the past couple of weeks. Um, I showed these in the previous video. These Vapor Max. I think these 2023 Vapor Max. Um, yeah, I got these when the uh, Nike app had that sale. It was like a 25% off sale. Some stuff might have been more than 25% off, but this is Vapor Max. Um, I, don't, I bought it to work in, so and when I went to. Uh, Z. I went to Sedona and stuff like that, so I walked in the LA Dusty as heck. Um, I paid, those were 112. I also got these on the same sale. So I can see they like, see these cream olive brown, lime green, or uh, what they call it, boat. Size 12s. Um, some people say you can go true to size me, which you probably could because it's not tight, it's pretty loose, it's pretty uh, movable or flexible, or whatever. But I wouldn't uh, have size up just because they run the shoes and run the shoes usually run tight on my feet. So uh, I, mean, I got the 12, so I can see the insoles. 
and this was my first pair of vapor mags and they're pretty comfortable you go you can feel you can feel the bottom of the stuff on your feet they still are pretty comfortable so, um, I like them. Yeah. Vapor Max up the back. Got Vapor Max on the tongue. Um, I don't think these came with no other color strings. I'm not sure though. I can't remember. I have to look at the box. And I got these, and I paid 102 for these. So I really got like two pair for the price of one. And one pair of these is 210, 210 brand new that you had on like shipping and taxes. Mm -hmm. You pay about two twenty-five, something like that. Um, also, I bought these. I didn't unbox these because I had got them the night before I was going out of town, and I just packed them with me. Um, I ended up getting these New York Mets, as you can see. Or New York Knicks, whatever, whoever they want, uh, whichever team you want to claim. Um, I got these from DTLR. Um, and also, I don't know why I always do this. I put in the raffle for these on SNS, right? Because I didn't know if they was coming out everywhere. But I happened to go to the mall one day to take something back to Macy's. And they was just sitting in the finish line. So I said, I'm just go to the store and get them. Then I seen that like Snipes had them and everybody else had them. So I went to the store cl close to me, grabbed them. Forgot that I put in for them on SNS and I won another pair. But my homeboy gonna buy those from me. So that's fair in a way. Um, so yeah, I got those. Obviously, to match with what I got going on, what I got on, I mean. Um, today is my lady birthday, so happy birthday to you. Even though you probably ain't gonna watch it, but if you ever seen it. Um, she had her eye on these for a minute, and she like love these earth tone colors. So, I copped her these. White and Pacific Moss. She loves these. I think they dope too. Um, I do like an olive green color. And it's going like, you got like camouflage stuff or something like that. Or you just like, you know, olive green. So I might get a pair. And these blue, these mesh color dunks is actually the first pair of dunks I've ever worn like um I do got the vintage dunks the vintage pandas um but I don't know if I'm gonna keep them like when I was buying dunks previously I was selling them because the resale was so high and it just wasn't no point to keep it and you know I me mean? I'm about my money so um I never kept a pair of dunks but I might get a pair of these she wanted us all to get a pair so I might, I might grab a pair. Oh, I like these colors. So I got these. Um, turn the homegirls, they going out with sister and stuff. And also, got, then I got those on the Nike sale too. Like, and then I ended up getting these too. Like, I just went shoot crazy. <laughs> like, you see these Air Ones. Uh, Air Force One 07, white, white, um, white brown. So, I had my eye on these for so many years, right? And I kept passing them up to get the all whites. And I always said, I'm gonna go back and get those. And then I never go back and get them. Then they'll sell out of my side. Or I just, just forget about it, so. I um, finally caught these joints. Just the white forces with the gum bottom.
You know what I'm saying? I'm yawning and carrying on, man. Been working like a, like a dog. And yeah, man. Drop my son off. Um, so, man. Yep, so I just got these. These is always a go-to, too. Like, especially here in Detroit. And it could be other places, too. But this is a go-to. Like, people... I ain't gonna say we'll pick these over the all whites, but it's a close second. Like, like you walked in the store and it was like these two sitting on the shelf, you would really be like, oh man, which pair should I get? And you may pick all white because the gum bottom might throw certain outfits off. Like, I don't know. It just you just may have on red and white, or you might have on green and white. But this color kind of go with those. Or just say you had on, um, I don't know, I don't know. Maybe not. Maybe this is just that little. This just the, that little off color that you need on some outfits. You know what I'm saying? So yeah, I'm digging these. Um, I haven't had a pair of gum bottom air ones. And, man, you know, they stopped making them for a while. If I can remember. But I haven't had a pair of gum bottom air force ones in so long. I can't even tell you the last time because, like I said, I probably was grabbing the all whites instead of these. But I'm wanting these too, you know what I'm saying? I don't know, but I finally got a pair. Um, and I also need a pair of John Elliott Air Force Ones in the 12. I got 11 and a half, but they tight because they got that, um, they got that, um, um zoom air in it. Got that thick foam, that thick, um, foam sole in it. They hella, they hella comfortable, but it's just they, they tight because that, that insole like push your foot up. And then it don't have no little air holes in the bottom of the knee. I don't think they got air holes, but it just got like the, uh, just the uh, imprint embossed. I think it's, yeah, I don't think they have no air holes. You know everything different. It's like double tongue, swoosh, and everything different. But I need a pair of those in the 12 for a decent price. If anybody see this video, if you got some that's brand new, I prefer. But maybe one or two wears, maybe. I don't want none that's all bent up or scuffed up if I gotta get used shoes. So, um, I have seen a couple pair. People want like 500 for them. I, I just, I don't know if I could pay 500 or like four or 500 for a pair of Air Force Ones. I just don't know. They are John Elliott, they are dope. But I don't know. Let's see, I'm gonna see if I can talk somebody down. Cause they were 150 retail when they came out. So for a brand new pair, I can I can see one over. They are John Elliott. John Elliott stuff is not cheap um, as far as prices. Like whatever you think of the quality is, it's really whatever you think. Um, but I know John Elliott shoes like 500. So I guess you could charge that much for a pair of John Elliott Air Force Ones, I guess. I don't know. They force it, so. I don't know. I know I'm going to have to pay over retail, but 400 500 I don't think so. I probably just want to. I'm just have to deal with the ones I got. They still look good. Um, no scuffs or nothing. So I'll still pull on if I got to. But yeah, um, I've been talking long enough. Um, 
As always, say, let me know what y'all thinking. Think of my pickup. Um, before y'all go, make sure y'all hit that thumbs up for your boy. Like I say, it always help out. Um, hit the subscribe button. You know what I'm saying? I'm still on a roll to monetization. Um, I'm gonna get there eventually. I'm gonna get there. Um, I'm just keep doing what I'm doing. I'm gonna add some stuff to this channel um, just for content, just besides unboxing. But it's still gonna be sneaker involved, fashion involved. Um, most importantly, log on to www.ufresh.com. Um, grab me some apparel. Um, got some new colors coming. Um, sh shorts coming. Um, I've been trying to get into the print shop for like a month now, man. But yeah, I do got to meet with the print shop. Um, so, some new colors and stuff coming. Um, some new designs going to be coming. Um, shorts. Um, and it's happened to the women's side. And yeah, it's really gonna be I, it's really gonna be all the apparel eventually, man. It just it's gotta get the ball rolling on stuff. That's it. But I've been rambling on long enough, man. This your boy always fresh, and now I get back with y'all in a minute.